Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So I decided to make the, the recording a little bit shorter and focus a little bit more on um, arena and stuff. I think I can have one day where I where I do the PvE stuff and then one day where I do the PvP stuff um, on video. And then I, at the same time I can talk about like what I, what I plan to do in terms of progression today. So for today I'm probably just going to keep working on my, my raid comp. I think it's a pretty good idea to, to get my orc and my Diane to to three stars max level as, as, as well as Olga. Um, I have all the materials for my my orc but my I don't have enough uh, of the main material as you can see right here I don't have enough of these things these runes of expertise you can get these from like all stages it's just I've been transmuting so much that I actually uh, ran out so I, I need to farm a few more of those and at the same time I'm farming stuff for for Olga um, and, and my stone golem and then afterwards I'm gonna probably work on Diane as well and then I think I'm gonna raise another um, probably gonna start raising the tanks until I can eventually get uh, another armor breaker which is this guy this guy's like the last armor breaker I need to complete my comp but the problem is he's not he's not farmable he's only summonable so I have to like kinda get lucky uh, if I if I do wanna get him but the good thing is he's, he's only two stars so he shouldn't be that difficult to get although there are certain two star monsters that I haven't been able to get yet anyways um we're, we're gonna do some do some arena battles and then I'll or arena and and Colosseum battles and then I'll I'll, I'll summon and um yeah, like I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna be perfectly honest. I'm not playing I'm playing this like super super casually. Like I'm playing lineage like really really casually. Not definitely not as serious as I, as I am before. Um, just it's it's just I'm not like as as um as passionate as I was about the game as I initially was. But I I'm still gonna keep playing. I think the game does, definitely does have potential like in the future. That's why I think I think it's still a a good idea to um. You know, to keep playing and see see how it turns out. I mean, it's not a lot of investment for me. Like, I just have to make a few clicks every single day to do. Um, actually, no, it's it's more than a few clicks. But I, I have to just click every single day to do some some quests and stuff. Holy shit! I got wrecked. Baited me. Ooh. Damn it! I lost. I think my arena comp's a lot stronger than my Colosseum comp. My Colosseum comp's hard. Like it's it's really hard to fight in Colosseum when everyone had like a shit ton of five stars and six stars. But I think I think it's hard for people in the arena to have like ten five stars. That would be really really difficult. But yeah, I've basically just been chilling, like farming slowly, um, slowly farming every single day, just like kind of just keeping up with the game, really. Not really actively trying to like stay in top 100 or anything like that. I think I, if I really, really tried during the last hour of the day, I might still be able to like for most, for the most part, stay in top 100. But it's just, it's just gotten so hard. I used to be able to just set a defense and just stay in top 100 the whole entire day, but it's. Um, it's really hard to do that when everybody else has like a whole bunch of five stars and six stars and stuff. And you're, you're, uh, you're like a lot of my best units are only three stars. Like my Death Knight, my, my Dell, people who are on my main team. Like I had to switch them out of my main team because I wasn't able to, to raise their levels anymore. Um, but I think definitely in the future when when more events roll out, we'll we'll definitely be able to make more five stars and six stars. And eventually, the free to play players will catch up. Um, I did. This spent a little bit when I first started playing the game. Like I wasn't initially full like pay to win, but I I I was I spent like just a little bit and I I um you know but since then I've basically been free to play the whole entire way. So I think yeah I think I think I think you can definitely um, still do pretty well if you if you play every single day um, as a free to play player. There's no boxes to open. We definitely need another event. Oh nice. Is this the free summon day? It is the free summon day. I got 20 soul stones for a 3 star pet. That's pretty awesome. That's really awesome actually. Although I already have the monster, it's um... 
It's still really good. Like I got 20 pieces for her basically. And she's a healer. She's a she's a pretty nice healer. So I, I definitely will be able to use her in the future for like guild battle defense and stuff. Um Yeah, that was a, that was a pretty good summon. That was that was a good pull. All right. Um I don't think there's anything else to to really do. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep farming up, and I'll see you guys um, in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and yeah, peace out.